morning, everybody. Hello. Oh, I'm a late like that. Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday morning and it's drizzling. Yeah, it's wet. We haven't had, I haven't woken up to rain in a long time. So good morning, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Hopefully you're enjoying the slightly cooler weather. It's been quite a lot cooler, hasn't it? Uh, we, I had a book group meeting last night and we actually met in person in someone's garden. There's only six of us. So we met in someone's garden all spaced out. And it was really lovely, but it did get a bit chilly. So um, it was really lovely to see everybody though. Good morning, Kaz. It, it, it doesn't, you know, even all these technologies, it doesn't replace face-to-face, -face, does it? It really doesn't. Good morning, Julie. So welcome everybody. Jean's here as well. My neighbour going up on his bicycle. Peter McCann, hello Peter McCann. So Peter McCann knows this, it's my 25th wedding anniversary today. 25 years, oh my God. Where is that time gone? It's shocking. Morning, morning, Carol. So yes, and it's also, I heard on, my, um, on the Alexa this morning, that it's the 77th anniversary of the invention of the biro, like the ballpoint pen, the bit, uh, no, the biro, the biro. So um, there we go, how exciting. <laughs> hey, I haven't got any more exciting news, that's it, that's as exciting as it gets. Hello, Veronica. Oh, thank you, Pete. The first 25 years are by far the easiest. <laughs> Yes, well, I keep saying to my husband, we're, we're getting on still, despite being in lockdown, so it must have been, you know, predestined. I think we've got a bit of a problem with the signal this morning, after I feel like I may lose you. If for any reason I freeze or something, bear with me, don't switch off, give it a couple of minutes and I'll try and get it back up again. Been having problems with all kinds of tech this last couple of days. Hello, Kat, thank you, thank you very much for all my happy anniversary wishes. Hi, Tracy and Diana. Yes, I know we're gonna have a we're gonna have a takeaway tonight. <laughs> that's a, that's the exciting plan. Uh, yeah, so it's, it's definitely slightly problem with the Wi-Fi. So just if, like I say, if I go, I am coming back. I haven't just decided to take the day off. Good morning. I will have a good celebration, Emily. Thanks very much. Right, we're gonna get going. So usual plan: two sets of exercises, ten exercises in each group. And we're doing each one for 40 seconds on and 20 seconds off. Work as hard as you like. If you want to use your hand weights, of course, use your hand weights. They just get your heart rate up more. They will increase your calorie burn. And they do a bit of toning for the arms too. I'm not doing that this morning because it's my anniversary. I don't have to. <laughs> Pete made me breakfast, which is very nice, but I'm a bit full. I'll be honest, a bit full. Anyway, we're going to get going. So I'm going to turn the volume up a little bit. We've got the Latin, uh, Latino salsa, that's what it's called. Let's get us going. Right, so, if this is your first movement of the day, give yourselves a little shake out. Oh, wake yourselves up. We're going to start gently. If you want to go for it, of course you can. If you've really been out running or something, then you just, uh, already lovely and warm. Let's use that thing. Hello, Diane. Thank you, Diane. Okay, let's march. So start with that bit. Now, if you're using hand weights, Keep a firm hold on them. We don't want anyone releasing them at their television or their iPad, do we? See those knees marching? Okay, come forward to me. Here we go, forwards. And then let's go backwards. Keep really tall for me, everybody. Let's go forwards again, forwards. Yeah. And then back. And let's go forwards again, forwards. Julie, good morning, Julie. Back you go. And Alison as well. Okay, let's go around a little circle. And we go. And march it here. Yeah. Oh, first one done. You can keep moving if you want to. Next one's going to be squats. Or you can do knee lifts instead. So squats today. We're going to start them quite narrow. And then we're going to go wide. So we've done that before. Kind of there in the foot position. Okay, let's go. Narrow ones first. So down. Up. So pushing into the, my heels, pushing my bottom backwards. It's really common to get knee pain with squats. Often it's because you're doing this. You're pushing forward with those knees. So think bottom. Bottom goes backwards. Now let's take those feet wide. Here we go. Wide feet. Down. And squats are a very good exercise for knees. I know they make knees sore. I feel like the next door, but actually they do strengthen, so they could strengthen the move. Back to the middle again, here we go. The four, three, two, one, yeah! Good. Okay, so the next one is probably going to have a bit of coordination. 
That one, yeah. Still resting. Still rushing, that's fine. So, yeah, my breakfast is running a bit heavy this morning, but if you want to get a bit more energetic, please do. Two steps and a knee lift. Here we go. Two steps, knee. As you lift up that knee, it's working your stomach muscles. So if you can, pull them in at the same time. Pull. Pull. Yes. It's hard to coordinate it sometimes, so don't stress. Yes. Okay, if you want to make it a little bit easier, have a little kick instead. You just kick it through. Because I don't mind how hard you're working. Some of you might use this as kind of an exercise and kind of really working hard. I think it's more of just a wake up, get going in the morning, which is absolutely fine. So don't feel you have to work it really hard if you're not in the mood. One more. Yes, well done. Shake yourselves out. We're going to go to windmills. And that's the one with the really fast, wide feet. So remember, don't do it here, because what happens is you'll hurt your knees. You've got to take those feet really wide. Toes are pointing out. Are you ready? Here we go. So just start side to side. I do like the music on this, uh, this track. It's kind of gets you going, even on a nasty, gloomy day. Side to side, you're going to start tap tapping. Tap side to side. That's it. So work on those tummy muscles, everybody. And with this one, a bit like squats, you're sitting back into your heels. So I'm sitting back. I'm not leaning too far forward because you'll end up falling over. <laughs> I would not want that. Side to side. A bit bigger. Last five seconds, here we go. Four, three, two, one, yes. Good place to shake hands. We're zooming through them as always. Hamstring curls next. So remember with that, it's a shift across and across. Because it's really hard to do hamstring curls with the body weight in the middle. This is good music. Ready for hamstring curls, here we go. Curl. Yeah. Now try and relax your shoulders, everybody. It's quite tempting to get a bit like that. And that's just going to hurt your neck. Good. Let's arm get going. Oh, I'm waking myself up now. I'd normally be for a dog walk this time in the morning, but not today. A nice breakfast. To walk later. Are we going those arms? Good. Breathe. Bring those arms low again. Hello, Cassie. Good morning. Seconds. Three, two, one. Good work. Shake yourselves out. Okay, we're going to go to lunges. Remember with lunges, straight up, push down and come up again. Push down and come up again. Just relax, we haven't started yet. We haven't started. We're still relaxing. Okay, here we go. Nice and tall. Good. So I can see. You might not be experienced at home, but I can feel that my signal's going to be an issue today. So, like I said, if you've just arrived, if I should disappear or just get frozen in the spot, don't run off, stay there, I'll sort it out. She says with great confidence. <laughs> okay, can we get a little bit lower? Now, if you're getting a sharp pain in your knee, please stop doing that. Do knee lifts instead, do marching instead. So don't do it if it's really sharp pain. Because it's horribly getting in pain, isn't it? A few more. One more. Yes, well done. Shake those arms out. Okay, we're going to go to the touch reach next. Which we know makes us really quite hot. So if you're still a bit chilly, you won't be in the moment. <laughs> Keep marching. Come on, let's just march in between the tracks. Okay, you ready to go? Here you go. Touch, reach. So I used hand weights with this last time and I found with the heavy weights I couldn't work quite this fast and that's fine. So if you're working slower, it doesn't matter. Some of you might be working quicker. There we go. Now put in those stomach muscles everybody. Can you touch your hand, your hand a bit lower down? That's it, a bit lower. Now obviously this is a disguise squat isn't it? That's Sarah. Hi Sarah. Tummy to pull in. Go on, give it last four. Here we go. Four, three, two, one, yes. Thank you for the tip for dog grooming, Sarah. I 
I've got my job booked up for next week. It has a two week notice period because it's so busy. She's just ridiculous. Everything's sticking to her. It's like a little magnet for weed and furs and grass. Okay, next one is a little kicking through. Oh, thanks. So a little kick through. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to walk forward doing this. Four, three, two, and then just march you back. Same thing again. Now, if you want to, you could skip. That's what I'm doing. That was just a demonstration. I'm doing more. Okay, so if you want to make it a little bit higher energy, you could do that. I won't know. And again, here we go. Four, three, two, one, and back. Last time, let's go forwards. Four, three, two, and back it up. Lovely. Okay, it's arm time. So it's going to be press up. If you want to make it easier, kneel on the floor, put your hands onto your sofa. The rest of this on the floor. Now, if you want to have your knees off the floor, of course you can. I'm not going to, but you can. So, hands on the floor nice and wide. We're going to start now. So we're going to do a little dip. It's going to go down, down, up. Now, we're not going to just keep dipping the whole time because it's exhausting. So hold it there. Hold. Okay, down we go again. Four little dips. Four. If you want to have a rest at any point, please do. Hold it again. Hold it there. Everyone breathe. Are you sucking your tummy muscles? Yeah. Stop nagging. Okay, here we go. Four dips. Four. Push. Three. Push. Two. Push. Last one. Hold it there. Hold. Oh, sit back. Well done. Give those wrists a shake out. And our last one of the first time through, two side steps. So we're going to take two steps that way, two steps back again. Here we go, two steps. Hello, Karen China. Good morning. Are you going to say hello? No, I'm too busy exercising. Okay, two steps. Two steps. Now, if you want to, you can make it a bit harder, look. So I did two steps one way. All right, two steps the other way. If you've got space, you go around the corner. And just to make it a bit more interesting, that's all. Don't have to do it. And again, two steps. Good, okay, back we go. And then just stay facing me. Two steps. Here we go. Get those arms working for me. God, oh, we're going to get warm. We're probably going to get hot, to be fair. And again, work those arms. And again. Lovely, much. Yeah, that's our first time through. Have a slurp of your drink. I'll drink some here. That was here from yesterday, so whether it tastes horrid. Actually, that's alright. A bit plastic but not too bad. Well done, everybody. So, first set done. If you're thinking, oh, I should work a bit harder, pick up your hand weight. If they're about one kilo ish, that's normally about right. I'd mine are two a bit heavy for this kind of pace. We're going to go for the beginning again. So, get yourself set. Oh. And I think we can put a little bit more oomph into it this time. In the rest period, we're just going to keep marching. Okay, you ready? Let's go. So the first one is going to march forward. So come forward to me. Here we go. You can jog if you want to. And back again. Oh, I'm getting my knees higher now. Arms, watch. We're going to go one, one, Two. And then just get back. Okay, let's do the same thing again. Here we go. Forward. One, one, two. And back. I like that one. Nice and simple. Makes your brain work a bit though. And back. Okay, so let's keep going. Here we go. One, one, two. Back you go. Okay, so that's it. We're going to keep moving. I'm going to walk forward. I'm going to be around the circle. So next exercise is a squat. And we're going to do squats narrow and squats wide. I'm just going to randomly march about. So you can as well. Probably looks a little bit weird. <laughs> okay. Change the music. Change of exercise. Squats. Normal width. Here we go. Down. Now if you want to make this more energetic, and getting the arms involved gets your heart rate higher quicker, especially if you're holding weights. 
So there's always that option to make things a bit more energetic without jumping about. Because we don't want to like that, do we? Feet wider, down. Yeah. So you can see what I'm doing. Just making those arms get involved. Option. Don't do them. Two more. One more. Good. And march it out. So, as I said, I went to a friend's with book group last night, which was lovely. Walked up Church Street, met three different people, had five minutes conversations with everybody, which was lovely. So, I was obviously late. <laughs> it's quite a social thing. People are much more keen to stop and have a chat, aren't they? Okay, two steps and the knee. Here we go. Two steps. Knee. So, you can make it bouncy. So, I'm trying to make it bouncy. Or you can keep it low and controlled. What about the arm coming over? Cool, why not? Good work, everybody. So don't forget, I've asked you to send me photographs of them exercising with me somewhere in their house, as long as it's not too exciting. And um, because I'd like to put up with some pictures for everyone else to see you guys. One more, here we go. Oh, if you don't want to, that's fine. So it's rather nice to see where people do their exercise. I've had Carolyn, she's sent me one. Um, oh God, a few other people sent me them. So um, if you want to, just put it on the chat and I'll um, see if I can find some technical way of putting them all together in one big photo. I'm going to work on it. Right, okay, next one, feet wide. Windmills. Here we go. Tap. A few people have been asking me when we're coming back. No idea. So we'll just keep doing this for the foreseeable future, guys, okay? Shift that weight across. Can we go a little bit lower? Oh, a little bit lower. Now I'm really working hard to suck in my stomach muscles. Because of that slight lean forward. And keep those arms going. Everyone breathe. Last four. Four, three, two, one, yes. Come on. How are we feeling? Getting feeling a bit better. A bit more perky. It does, it really helps. A bit of exercise first thing in the morning. It really helps to get your endorphins going. It makes your happy hormones boost you a bit. Which I think is worth its weight in gold. Okay, hamstring curls. I think if you're feeling a bit glum at the weekend, so I know I don't do any classes at the weekend, but if you're feeling a bit glum, get one of the videos. There are loads of them, aren't my videos? It's just too often to do it. About 10 minutes, 15 minutes, well, 20 minutes. Um, it's going to help. Just cheer you up a little bit, I think. I hope. I hope it's make you miserable. <laughs> okay, let's work hard. Get those arms up high. Go on, really hard. The last 10 seconds. Go on, you can do it. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Good stuff. Okay, it's our lunges. I know not everyone likes them. You can hear the ooh, the groan across the country. <laughs> so we're going to do them if you want to. If not, do one of the other ones we just did. It's fine. Straight back. Toe muscles pulled in. Here we go. Little lunge. Now when I'm lunging, I know I'm looking at you, but normally I'll be looking straight forwards and I'm putting in my tummy to keep my balance. Because they can get a bit wobbly, can't they, lunges? So if this is you, a wobble. But what you do is fix your eyes straight ahead, pull in your stomach muscles, maybe slow it down a little bit. You don't have to go fast if you don't want to. This is a great strength and balance challenge. But it is a challenge. Okay, let's go. Last 10 seconds. Yeah, keep breathing, everybody. Last five seconds. You always feel these ones. Three, two, one, yes. Yeah. Shake it out. Okay, get a march about. This is the one that always gets me really hot. It's the touching and reaching high. So keep marching. Ooh. Are you ready? Here we go. The touch, reach. And again, it's because we're doing a squat and then we're getting those arms involved. Can we take our hands a little bit lower? A little bit lower. Oh, there we go. Come on, let's really work it. Pulling your stomachs. I'm 
need to have that ripped across my t-shirt. Suck in your tummy. And again. Okay, last 15 seconds. Come on, let's work hard. We're going to be lying down in a minute. So it's bite side Pilates is lying down today. I don't know if that's good or bad, really. Two. One more. Oh, ha, ha. well done. Check it out. Okay, so I'm going to do a kick step forwards and then march it back. You might see lots of um, construction traffic going by over the next few days. Come forward to me because I've started building an estate just down the road. I saw all the stuff out there yesterday, so that might give us a bit of disturbance. But never mind, as life goes on. Okay, let's kick it forward. If you want to, you could skip. And then go back. We can all skip, can we or can't we? Anybody who went to All Saints School, Clifton, you can skip. Anyone with children who went to All Saints School, you know your kids can skip. Maypole dancing. Oh, they're missing it this year. Oh. And again, let's go forward. And back. Good stuff. That one's done. Again, just march and get ready to circle. This is our rest. We're resting. Let's go around the other way. So next one. Oh my goodness, we've got two more to go. It's going so quickly today. Down to the floor. Press ups. Use the hands if you use the chair. Hands wide if you're doing it on the chair. You push. Everyone off you go. So this is my demonstration. Everyone else, you're on the floor. And using chairs just takes the pressure off your wrists a bit as well. So if you're having struggles with your wrists, sit in the hold. Hold. Let's press up again. For four, three, two, one. And hold. How are you doing? Oh, it's hard this one, isn't it? Hold it there, tummy's in. Last four press ups. For four, three, Two, one more. Oh, sit back. They never get any easier press ups. They really don't. Okay, onto our feet if you can. Oh, my legs are like lead today. I don't know why. Sometimes, some days, you're just like, oh, my legs can I feel like that. I don't know why. There's no reason. Okay, side steps. Here we go. Two steps and back. Now, those of you aerobics people, you might want to do a great vibe. Because we like a grapevine. <laughs> two steps again. So it's two steps. Arms, come on. Let's work them. Anybody fancy a grapevine? <laughs> oh, it's like being back in the community centre. Double side steps. Here we go. Two steps. And back. And again. Ready for that grapevine if you want to have a go? takes a bit of coordination. Don't stress out if you're struggling with that one. Double side step to finish. Three, two, last one. Yes. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. Very, very well done, everybody. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Are we all right? Everyone's warmed up. Yeah, so classes will continue for the meantime, everybody. Don't be worried. I will give you plenty of notice when I need to change anything. Uh, but I can't see that happening anytime in the near future at all. So yeah, we'll stay together, won't we? Good. Next one, bite size. It's on in five minutes. So if you've never done it before, join us for it. We're going to be on the floor. We're going to do some stretching and a little bit of core work. It's not too onerous, is it? It's quite fun. So I will see you in five minutes, everybody. And thank you very much for all the congratulations on my wedding anniversary. Bye, everybody.